British-born Mark Colvin became one of Australia's finest news and current affairs broadcasters, a man who brought some of the biggest international stories to Australian radio and television audiences for nearly four decades from 1980. He wanted to be like Mark because uh, he was scholarly, he was wise, he was multilingual, uh, he was well-read, uh, he ha had a lot of skills that I didn't have, uh, but beyond that he had a brilliant sense of humour. Mark was a fantastic journalist, he had this great brain and he had this unquenchable uh, curiosity. As a foreign correspondent, he married vivid descriptions with superb context and background. War could begin because of a deliberate decision by the United States to invade Eastern Europe. Belson is an unforgettable symbol of humanity's capacity for atrocity. But the guerrillas have the advantages of invisibility and stealth. I first covered an African famine 15 years ago, and since then I've seen quite a lot of death and disease, but I have never seen anything like the road we've just travelled. Between postings, he was the founding presenter of the ABC radio program, The World Today, and from 1997 was host of the evening program, PM, a role he held for 20 years. Good evening and welcome to PM. I'm Mark Colvin. Mark inspired many colleagues to become ABC journalists and then to become better journalists because of his professionalism courage and resilience in the face of debilitating diseases. And he came into that studio when I read my first bulletin and sat beside me. And I can remember he leant across and he just put his hand on my hand to steady me. And it was such a respectful, caring, collegiate thing to do. And I can't begin to describe what that's like when you're that scared, you know, and he was that kind of person, that's what he did. ABC colleague Tony Jones described him simply as the greatest broadcaster of the ABC's modern era and without doubt an acknowledged national treasure. Uh, Mark Colvin was as elegant as he was erudite, a prodigious reader, he was as well informed as all of us would like to be, and more so.